Side 2's Operation Make Faster Game, which is also known as OMFG. Um, you can check out, and I'm sure a lot of you guys who have played Planet Side have, you can check out the videos of them doing this and how the dev team goes through this to improve the game's frame rates. Um, they have that available on the main uh, launcher. So you can take a look at those. There are seven episodes, I believe, so far. Um, and it goes through like the animation process, um, the objects, all that stuff to make the game faster. Less objects, uh, less stuff on the screen. It's a very systematic process to improve the game's performance. And um, they are coming to a close with that as they have um, released the patch and the test servers. Um, Supposedly, according to PlanetSide 2 devs, the performance could be increased as a whole anywhere from 20 to 50 percent, um, especially on mid to lower range computers. The performance was supposedly much better. Um, so that's good because a lot of people cannot play PlanetSide 2 on lowest even because their computers are too old or don't have enough power to run the game. Uh, Personally, I don't have that issue. I, I don't want to say I have a high-end computer, but I have a computer that can run the game um, with maximum frame rates with no issues. Uh, the highest settings, as you can see here, uh, 1920 by 1200 resolution. Uh, everything's maxed out, of course. I, I Personally, I cannot play a game without maxed out graphics quality. It's just, to me, that's part of the what the devs want you to play with. They want you to experience the game with the highest graphical quality that they offer. So it would be wrong to not use it in that sense. So I always max out my settings. But OMFG, since I said it was released in the test servers, I'm not sure the feedback yet. Um, I'm hoping it's a positive thing because I couldn't. I wouldn't mind the frame rate increases, and I know a lot more people could get to the, play the game if frame rates were improved. Um, so it's it's definitely a great thing that they're really focusing on improving the game's quality while still maintaining uh, you know the the core features of the game. Uh, it's very impressive that they're following like people's ideas and thoughts on this. Is it? Um, you know, if they get negative feedback, they really, really, really try to find a way to alter that. Um, so, it's really good to me and interesting to me that the devs clearly care about this game a lot. SOE, people complain about a lot. I think they're actually a very good system. Uh, they have done wonders, especially with this game. They really work hard to make everyone enjoy the game experience. And I know that this OMFG thing, if it works, then more people will play the game too. So it's just going to be an all-around win-win uh, with this. So if we're lucky, it'll be released on the, te on the live server soon. I don't know when the ETA is. Uh, if I do know it, learn what the ETA is, I will post it in the description for you to read. Otherwise, I do not know. But... Uh, it's, like I said, I'm really excited for this. I have friends who cannot play the game because of the frame rate issues. And to me, it's just really annoying that they have to be left out because they can't play. I mean, if you don't if you don't get a decent frame rate, like 30 to 60, killing people in the game is going to be very difficult. Uh, everybody's going to have an edge on you, pretty much. Um, because, you know, skill levels will only take you so far if you're not getting adequate frame rates to play the game. Uh, but yeah, like I was saying, I'm really excited for OMFG to be released on the live servers because I could use, even I could use the frame rates because my frame rates in the big battles drop sometimes to 30 or below. And you know, you don't, you want a very uh, stable frame rate. You don't want to have to, uh, you don't want to lose frame rate a lot in the middle of battle because it'll fuck up your 
like uh, response to actions. You know, if your mouse sensitivity is this way, if you get a freeze and it locks over to a different location, then you might die. You know, there's just a lot to it. But um, yeah, um, I'll be doing more videos, of course. I will always do more videos. And if there's a delay between time I do videos, it's not because I'm just like fuck this channel. It's because I'm always doing something else. Uh, even today, I plan on uploading a couple more videos. Uh, so keep that in mind. Uh, definitely keep tabs on OMFG, and hopefully it'll come on the live server soon. So thanks for watching. This was a Sablecraft video. It was Malachi21 talking, um, and I'll see you on the next big adventure.